Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So, as you may have noticed, my smile is a bit weird today. Because I actually broke one of my veneers here in the front. And because I bit on something hard. Well, not that kind of hard. <laughs> well, anyways. So today I'm gonna go to my dentist and get it fixed. But I won't just have one tooth fixed. I'm gonna have everything replaced. So I hope you guys will join me for my journey for a new smile. Hi, Bailey. So I'm about to leave the house on my way to the clinic. This is where my dentist clinic is located. This is J Center Mall. When I got into the clinic, I was sprayed with disinfectant and was given a PPE to wear with hair bonnet and now I was given some antiseptic mouthwash before they can start any procedure. No. <laughs> no. This is Dr. Hi. So we we're done with the anesthesia. The first procedure done here by Doc Amore was she cauterized some parts of my gums. Because I have a very gummy smile and my gums are hypersensitive and they easily bleed so she was able to fix that by cauterizing parts of it so after the cauterization process she applied some more anesthesia so she could start with the second procedure which was shaving off or sanding off the bony parts where the gums were located. It was a very bloody procedure as you can see. I look like Joker from the Batman. <laughs> We're done with part one. So they removed a lot of part of my gum. It's still bleeding. guys so two weeks ago I was at Amore Dental and Doc Amore did uh, two procedures on my on my mouth so the first procedure was she cauterized some part of my gums so she cauterized here from like here to here the reason why she did that because I have a, a very gummy smile and when I laugh or smile naturally, my all of my gums would show and I don't think it looks so nice. <laughs> so that's, she removed a part of my gums. And the second procedure she did was she shaved off a part of, of the bones here. Yes, you heard that right, the bones. She shaved off a part of it so the new veneer she'll be installing will fit properly. So today, I'll be going to the dentist again. And what she will do is now that my gums have healed, she can go ahead and remove my old, my old veneers and replace them with temporary ones. Because um, she's supposed to 
put in uh, Emax porcelain veneers. But that will take some time because the, the porcelain veneers has to be made at a laboratory and it would have to be fitted properly accordingly to in my mouth. So the fit is perfect. So while we wait for that, she would, I'll be wearing um, temporary veneers on my teeth. We're at Jewel Center Mall. Now inside the clinic, this is Doc Amor. So we have another procedure today. Mm. Later. So Doc Amor is preparing a mold here where she will be using to take a perfect measurement of my mouth. So the fitting for the veneers will be precise and accurate. After taking the measurements, Dr. Moore is now administering anesthesia in preparation for the next procedure. After removing my old veneer, Dr. Moore is now shaving or sanding off my old teeth. These are my original teeth. <laughs> so my old veneers have been removed and the sides have been shaved in preparation for the new one. I look like a piranha. <laughs> What's your dog? Oh, rubber impression. Ah, okay. So this takes longer than the regular impression. So we have to wait for four minutes. Okay. This is for the rubber impression. Very good for taking the mold space. Finest details. You will, able, you will be able to get the, the copy of the details of the teeth. Even to the tiniest details. So the fitting of the impact is very, very accurate and very tight. Most pieces were put the debris to get in so that you, you, your mouth won't get smelly. Mm. If, if the veneers are kanang loose or there's a kanang there's space, mm -hmm. food will get in and then you have bad breath. Mm. So that's why I'm just taking the yeah, correct bite. It's called a bite registration. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's also made of rubber. Open. Okay, it's a bite. And then you will take the impression of the mirror. Okay, 
English ng Nilo Doc. Sensitivity. <laughs> <laughs> Nag-vlog-vlog ko ni Wotin. Inch and Nilo, right? Eh? Discomfort na lang kung ganyan. Sensitivity. Sensitivity. So these are like dentures stuff or no? Maran shot the space so or did it? In between, What are you inserted it all together at once? Mm, so, huh? That's why you have to. After installing the temporary veneers, Docamore is now polishing it so it will be all smooth inside. Ooh, so we're done for the day. I'll be I'll be back in a week for the final part, the doc now. So I have my temporary veneers right now. I'll be wearing this for a week. Hello everyone. Welcome back. It has been a week since the last dental procedure. So remember last time, um, the doctor sanded off or shaved off part of my teeth. And while waiting for the new veneers to be finished by the laboratory, I was fitted with temporary ones. And today, Doc Amor will be removing them and replacing them with the porcelain veneers or better known as Emax veneers and I am so excited to be able to see and feel my brand new smile so come join me as I visit Amore Dental and get my brand new smile I'm here at the mall now on my way to Amore Dental and the first thing Dr. Moore did was administer some anesthesia in preparation for the next procedures and now she is removing the temporary veneers that she installed a week ago After removing the temporary veneers, 
She is now doing a initial fitting of the porcelain veneers to see if I would like it or not, or if the fitting is perfect or not. that the veneers will properly stick to my teeth. And now she is applying fluoride to protect my teeth from hypersensitivity or better known as Nilo here in Cebu. After the initial fitting of the veneers, and with my approval, Doc Amor is now installing the veneers per tooth. So she is using a, a cement or adhesive to properly secure the veneers on each tooth. Now this is a long procedure as the doctor had to make sure that each veneer is properly secured in each tooth and they would use the blue light which is the dental curing light used to seal and set the veneers on the tooth or teeth. Another thing Doc Amor had to make sure was the spaces between the veneers are there. So she flossed each in between to make sure that there's still space between each veneers. Now this is the most exciting part for me as the final piece was added and I was very happy to look at all of it together. Once everything was in place, it was time to seal and set them with the blue light. And now Docomore is making sure that the in-betweens are there and there are still spaces between each tooth and now she is polishing it to make sure that everything is smooth Oh, 
right? And then slide slide your you know, lower jaw okay, forward to the slide slide forward. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like do like this one. Now I'm mentioning it. Okay, I'll assist this again. Okay. Slide forward. And then side to the side. Bite again. Bite. Normal bite. Normal bite. Slide to the side. Okay. Perfect. Again, bite. Okay. What? 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 Okay. 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 So that is after brushing. After brushing, make sure you use the water to wash it because it removes all the debris that's hiding under the gum. Meron na sa mga Shopee, mga lang. Oh, yeah. I think there is, but there's one available in Mander. Okay. Ah, okay. All the orders, all the orders on online Amazon. This is the original brand water stick, but there are other brands like Chilean and Ron. It's usually available in appliance stores. So if I do that, I don't have to floss anymore. You don't have to floss. This is better than floss. So more water pressure than charm. Actually, they call this um, water flosser. Mm -hmm. uh, water in a floss. Instead of using floss, you can use that. Yeah. And then this keeps your gums healthy. Right? Mm -hmm. what, what makes your gums bleed is the food that's trapped inside the gums. What about mouthwash? Mouthwash, I don't recommend using those that have alcohol. Mm -hmm. So yeah. I'd rather you gargle with. Um, Himalayan salt. Okay, yeah, yeah. That's or what I've been doing. The pink, pink, pink Himalayan yeah. salt, yes. That's it. That's how you take it. Okay. And then I have it cleaned every six months. Every six months. Yeah. Okay. Yay! <laughs> Brand new smile. Okay, that's it. The trip has. Okay, bye. Again. This is more durable than the composite, no? This is better than composite. And then, I require you to come back after two weeks for recall. Now, the purpose two of weeks? The, yeah. two weeks? The purpose of the recall is I check if there are any debris left mm -hmm. in the cement, and then I check your bike. Okay. okay. It's just a recall. Uh, I check my veneers. How your how is it cleaning? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can't feel my lips on it. Yeah, the 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 first group and bigger. When it's alive, it's so thick. Mm -hmm. So I make sure this is a little bit forward, this is backward, a little bit. So that's how natural teeth are arranged. If you see the the heads, the heads, like that. Mm -hmm. And then the teeth are arranged like that. Mm -hmm. Never, never align together like this. Because if you align together, it looks like a thicker one. It's based on the teeth. Oh, 
old shots, no? The, yeah. the, the, the before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I can compare, ba? So I can... Yeah. Hi guys, so I am back home now and I waited for a few hours for the anesthesia to, to wear off so I can talk properly and I can smile properly. So this is it, this is the, the final product. So this is Emax Porcelain Veneers by Amore Dental Clinic. I'll be posting all the information on my description down below so you can you guys can check it out or if you can make inquiries if you're interested in the in the procedure. So yes, this is my brand new smile. And I'm so happy. It was worth all the all the hours of those long procedures which were very very uncomfortable all those drilling and shaving and my mouth was wide open most of the time my jaw hurts it was all worth it when I when I when I looked into the mirror and I saw this <laughs> and I don't have to cover my mouth anymore when I laugh because the smile is perfect and it's all because of Amor Dental Clinic and thank you so much to Doc Lorna Amor for my smile I, I love it I really really love it and I'm just so happy I'm, I'm speechless right now because of how how beautiful they are I cannot wait to take a lot of photos and see what my friends would say. Doc Amor, thank you so much for everything. Thank you so much for the patience and for working all those hours with me. And for being sensitive and also listening to what I wanted. And yes, it was it was a perfect job perfect. I can't stop looking at it well enough let's stop there so guys thank you so much for for joining me in this journey for a brand new smile and I have finally found it and achieved it. It's a lot more prettier than what I expected. And I am so happy. I've said it a million times already. I'm so happy. Well, because it's true. I'm, I'm just so happy with it. I'm so happy with the final product. And thank you so much for watching. And I hope you guys will subscribe to my channel. Until next time.